This is the SP Series Programmable Controller from SH Scientific. We use this high accuracy controller for our high temperature muffle furnaces, tube furnaces, and vacuum furnaces. This video will explain how to set up this controller with ramp up and hold programs of up to 30 steps between two patterns. First, turn on the main switch. The upper window shows the current temperature inside the chamber, and the lower window shows the operation status. Right now, the furnace is not in operation, so you see stop. Now we need to set a temperature. Press and hold the set button for 3 seconds to enter the program setting mode, which is represented by program. Click the set button to set your pattern number, which displays alongside pattern number. Like I briefly mentioned earlier, our SP Series controller has Pattern 1 and Pattern 2. You can set up to 15 steps apiece for a total of 30. Input your pattern number 1 and then click the Set button. The display will change to 1LC, at which point you can pick one out of the following four ending modes to take effect after the final step in this pattern. RST will stop operation. Hold will hold the temperature. Pattern 1 will repeat Pattern 1. And Pattern 2 will repeat Pattern 2. Here, I selected RST. So the furnace will simply stop when the final step is done. Next, we see 1 SSP, which is the prompt for a starting temperature for Pattern 1. The typical choice here is zero, so we'll go with that. Click the set button, and next you'll see 1SP1, which is the first target temperature you want to reach. I've set 800 degrees Celsius. Click the set button again, and it displays 1TM1, which is the time at which you want to reach the temperature you've just entered. I'm using two hours. Click set again to see 1TS1. Just keep it set to off since we don't use this function. Click set again for 1SP2, which is the second temperature you want to reach or hold. I'm using 800 degrees Celsius again, which means 1SP2 is the same as 1SP1. So in effect, it will just hold 1SP1 straight through. Now, click set and you'll see 1TM2. I've entered two hours here. So once the furnace reaches 800 degrees Celsius, it will hold for 2 hours. Hitting set again brings up 1TS2, which we don't use, so we'll keep it off. Next, you'll be prompted for the third temperature and time. I'm using 850 degrees Celsius and 30 minutes. After that is the fourth temperature and time. So I'll use 850 degrees Celsius and 30 minutes again, which tells it to hold 850 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes. Let's recap the program thus far. Step 1 is to reach 800 degrees Celsius in 2 hours. Step 2 is to hold 800 degrees Celsius for 2 hours. Step 3 is to reach 850 degrees Celsius after 30 minutes. And finally step 4 is to hold 850 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes. Now, to end the program, I'll enter 0 for 1SP5 and OFF for 1TM5, so the furnace will stop after step 4. Click the set button to see 1RPT, which is the option to repeat all the preceding steps. I've set it to 1, which means no repeat. We recommend that you use 1 as well, just to avoid repeating the program unintentionally. At this point, I've finished entering the program, so I'll press and hold set for 3 seconds to return to standby mode. Then, press and hold the pattern button for another 3 seconds to start the controller. Finally, press on, and the furnace will begin heating up. As it runs, you might want to keep an eye on the status and progress. To see the current output ratio of the heaters, briefly click the set button one time. Be careful not to hold the set button down, since that would take you back into program mode. To see which step the furnace is, briefly click the set button once again. It is now at step 1. 
you can also see the remaining time for the current step. Finally, two other things to note. Step off is a default setting. If you change it to step on during operation, it will skip the current step and force it to jump to the next step. Hold off is also a default setting. If you change it to hold on during the operation, then it will hold the current step indefinitely or until you turn the furnace off. Thanks for watching, and on behalf of the whole SH team, we look forward to being of service.